Okay guys, welcome to the playthrough of XCOM Enemy Unknown. Now I tried to do this last night and for whatever reason I absolutely butchered the audio so hopefully now you can hear me. Um, I'm sure in the comments below if you can tell me if the audio needs changing just tell me that's absolutely fine so without further ado we're going to jump into it to normal mode. Now I remember playing XCOM about 10 odd years ago. Fantastic game and I'm really looking forward to the new one. So what we'll be doing is we'll be uh, putting on so many parts of the playthrough per, per day or every couple of days whenever I can get on to do it and, uh, and going through the entire story until it's finished. I'll leave any cutscenes in we can and, uh, and do my very best for you lovely lovely people. Giant green meteor from the sky. Go near it, probably a bad idea. Well, he had to poke the damn thing. Well done, that was your own fault. Well, that's your shit storm. And now time to kick some ass. In light of the recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative to oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. We urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. Good luck, Commander. Right, now the lucky people in North America may have to play since Tuesday. We just got our hands in it on Friday, so we'll do our that best to catch up with it. Patch me through to Voodoo 3 1. Okay, Hamburg, Germany. Gonna go and find the bogies. You are being deployed to Germany. Central, this is Big Sky. Looks like we found the crash site. Roger, Voodoo 3 1. Any sign of activity? Okay, set her down nearby. Straight away, well, I've got to tell you, the visuals are absolutely lovely. They seem to have taken the time, and it really does look very, very nice. Anyone hear the music? Kind of Deus Ex, kind of like this. First, let's get you out of the open and into cover. Whatever did this could still be out there. Delta One, take point. Take cover behind that debris directly in front of you. So, for those of you new to the game or just wanting to see about buying it, it relies on a cover-based system. Either you've got soft cover, like on uh, there, where you've got part cover or full cover behind an object like that statue right there, which has got the full shield. So if someone attacks you and you're behind Delta medium two, cover, you're not going to take full damage, or if you're behind full cover, you might not take any. Obviously, it's a, it's all down to a dice roll mechanic. That thing isn't going to offer you much cover, but it's better than nothing. There's full cover straight ahead. Advance to that position. Delta 3, move to the... Central, I have movement. 
30 meters north of my position. Police vehicle. Roger. Proceed to the next vehicle for a better vantage point. Delta 4, go check it out. It's a long way. Holy hell. What do you see, Delta 4? Oh, he's, uh, he's awful pretty. Looks like one of the recon teams, sir. It looks like something. Is that your man, Delta 4? Negative, sir. That's someone else. Oh my stomach if I'm really hungry. Dr. Vollin, really, really hungry. He is saying, help me. That radio transmission is coming from somewhere north of the squad's current position. Based on its strength, probably from inside a structure. Thank you, Doctor. Could be. Advance and infiltrate that Could be, Doc. And remember, stay in cover. So it just first level seems just to act like a little bit of a tutorial, just telling you how not to die and drill the cover mechanics in, which is nice. They don't put you straight out in the game, which is always Check nice. Four. I got a lot of blood here. Roger. See where it's coming. So, oh, bad day. Oh, it's left over. Really bad day. For this guy makes sense. Looks like he's been dead for a week. Even more perplexing is the cause of death. It appears that he was eviscerated when something burst out of him from the inside. Sir, I have visual on the object. Permission to approach. It's the only cover between you and that building. Permission granted. Talk to me, soldier. What is it? I got no idea what this thing is, but I can confirm that it's no satellite. Roger. Well, he's honest. Right, I'll give him that much. You're almost to the building. Keep moving. Okay, people. Now let's get inside. Delta One, there's a window in front of you. Let's take a look. In position. It's really nice how it removes it and transitions so that you can go into there through the window. Delta Two, that door's in our way. Take it down. That looks like we're going through then. He looks friendly, Central, holding a hand contact. grenade. He's armed. Copy Delta Three. Okay, everyone, get into position nearby, but do not approach. Doctor, see if you can communicate with him. Tell him to drop his weapon. I will try. Hello, können Sie mich hören? Wir sind hier, um Ihnen zu helfen. Bitte lassen Sie Ihre Waffen fallen. He appears to be in shock. Keep your eyes open, people. I don't like the looks of this. Delta three, move in and disarm him carefully. Not that it's a trap, but could uh, could kind of be a trap. <clears throat> Hey, have this grenade, it's my friend. My oh no. Oh, son of a bitch. That's two of us down. Not great. Central, we're taking fire for multiple X-rays. This guy's got me pinned down, taking heavy fire. Damn it! Delta two, your flank two. Find some better cover. All right, Delta two. Weapons free. Get ready to fire. Thank you. Forward. You're freed up to move. Get out of there and get forward. into cover. Now toss your grenade at the enemy in front of you. Doesn't always have to be a gun. You can use a grenade or different objects next up. 
let's land this right on top of this guy. It's like playing an old game of worms. And go! Now get ready for their counterattack. Look out, Delta Four. There's another one coming in behind you. Ah, damn it. Nuts. It's just you now, Delta Two. Let's tip the odds. One and left, then. Let's Look flank him. A position where you can flank the enemy. That's it. You have a clear shot from that position. Fine. And your ass is mine. Central, I think that's it. It's over. Roger that, Delta. Secure the bodies and head back to the Sky Ranger for immediate extraction. Ah, bit of a baptism of fire there, killed three of ours. Not great. Part of the tutorial though, not really avoidable, I don't think. So, now I have to choose where our base is. We can either be in North America and have all aircraft and aircraft weapons cost 50% less to purchase, build and maintain. Or we can be in Europe. Laboratories and workshops cost half as much. Less to build and maintain. Now I would love that because I'd love to do some research. Affirmative. We are coming home. I'm gonna say aliens. Whatever they are, they nearly took out a squad of our best soldiers. Again, if you'll aliens. excuse me, doctors. The commander is waiting in mission control. Their technology is far beyond ours. Then I'd say our work is cut out for us, doctor. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. I'm Central Officer Bradford. My role in this project is twofold, providing tactical support for our field operations and keeping you briefed on the current situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Right then, thanks for tuning in. That's our first part of the playthrough. You enjoy me next time, we'll, uh, we'll get a Commander bit further into it for you. Commander to the barracks.